football season here in Missouri. And I actually flew into town two weeks ago, and I've been bowing pretty hardcore just about every day. So I've been seeing a couple different bugs, some does and some fawns. And I actually had two encounters over the last two weeks with two shooters.
Well guys, it's Monday, November 15th. It's about two o'clock right now. Uh, I kind of have a little story to tell about the buck I had shot two days ago on opening day rifle season here in Missouri. Um, it's been a long weekend, very stressful, very upsetting and nerve wracking. Two sleepless nights, um, been having bucks on my mind all weekend. And I've been having this specific buck that I had shot opening morning on my mind. Um, past two days, we've been tracking and trailing this deer hardcore. Didn't want to give up. I knew he was wounded really bad. I mean, he was quartering away when I shot, and I blew his upper shoulder blade just to pieces. Um, so throughout all of Saturday, after the shot had happened, we had trailed him for quite a ways on to two of the neighbors. We both got permission to walk both of their properties and continue trailing. Backed on out, went back that same afternoon and evening, continued trailing and tracking this deer and went back yesterday and I had Caden, Brady and Ty with me. Um, we were out there for two hours trying to track this deer and hopefully walk up on it and possibly get a shot on him. And so we did that and I had split away from the group, split away from them and I was with Cooter the dog. and. We stayed close to the creek because I figured he would bed down by a creek and they were just went over a ridge and they had actually jumped him. So at that time we pushed to the left, we pushed north toward back towards the road. And we happened to not, we did not see the deer after that. We all made it back to the road and the deer had went south. He went towards another one of our neighbors and for some reason that we were all just kind of were bummed out, tired of walking and got back to the truck and went back to the cabin and they all were hungry. They went and got food. And so I had a gut feeling. Something was telling me that this deer was wounded and he was still in the area. And so I got on Onyx, drew a little circle, triangle map of where I think this buck would have been. Talked to Caden. He's like, man, I think he's in there too. So I had a feeling this buck was in that area. I went back to the cabin with them, got something to eat. And then I went back out because something was telling me he's in there and I might get another shot. So I go back up north of the property, get onto the neighbor's property where we have permission, walk down there, go down a ridge, and I come up another ridge. And sure enough, I thought I was seeing things. I mean, I saw an antler behind a cedar tree, and I was like, is that a limb or is that an antler? So I walked 10 yards to the right down the ridge, closer to the creek, got the binoculars out, looked, didn't see anything, and then I hear something, and I look up, and he, that buck, didn't know what buck it was. Got up, ran 30 yards up the ridge, and sure enough, I saw his like front right shoulder all just limpy and just kind of dangling like this. And Dad told me, he's like, if you see your deer, throw your gun up and shoot. And he specifically told me that. So I threw the gun up, shot, don't know where I hit him. And then I went over to the shot where that had taken place. Got on blood and looked like good blood, bright red. So the deer had been shot at twice. And he, I knew he was really wounded, and I knew he was going to die. So I backed on out. And then today, Caden, Dad, and myself went back in there. And I knew exactly where he probably died at. And sure enough, we got on the blood, followed it quite a ways, went over two ridges. And something was telling me where I had thought he had fallen and died at, he was right there. So I took off running in front of Caden and my dad. They were still just wanting to follow blood. I was like, no, something my heart's telling me right where he's at. I take off running over the next ridge and I just see him laying right there. opening day rifle season buck 2021 I mean it was awesome weekend's just been stressful and it, today's Monday so weekend's over with and yeah it was a great weekend um, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video and thanks for watching